Hello everyone, Pixel Monk here. For more videos about gaming news, make sure to subscribe. It's been four months since the release of Batman Arkham Knight. When launched, it was buggy, beyond belief, and unplayable. Now it's back on the market and many people are still complaining that this game is not working. Shortly after the release yesterday, Warner Bros. announced a blog post that warns of GPU problems for Windows 7 users, which will cause a hard drive paging issue after extended gameplay sessions. To fix this, a player must reset the game. On Windows 10, it's recommended that you have at least 12GB of RAM to operate without paging and provides a smoother gameplay experience, states Warner Bros., which is quite a bit more than the minimum system requirements for Windows 7 and 8 of 6GB of RAM. Many people are still complaining that the frame rate is set at 30 frames per second and one player states, My PowerPoint presentation gets frames faster than this game. On Steam, there are more negative reviews about this game than there are positive, making this an ultimate failure. What I don't understand is that after all the trouble that the customers have been through with this game, that Batman Arkham Knight is still selling for $50. Let me know your opinions, thanks for watching, and make sure you subscribe, like, and share this video to Facebook and Twitter. See you next time.